What's going on, YouTube? Hot Wheels fans, diecast fans. Been looking for this thing. Been waiting for it, rather. Luckily, I didn't have to look too hard. Um, I had some friends help me out, get me this. Um, the new Nissan Hot Wheels Premium set. This thing's pretty cool. It's actually really cool. It's awesome. Um, unfortunately, this set here has a little dancing hauler, so this will be the one I open up. Everything looks nice and clean in there. I don't think anything got damaged. Uh, super excited to open this. It's late at night. I should be sleeping, but I've had, I was so busy all day. Um, just trying to get to open a, a bunch of cool diecasts that I have on hand right now, but it looks like I had to choose one and this was definitely going to be it. Um, so let's get to opening this thing. Uh, take a quick look at it all around. There's the back of it. And we got a Datsun 510 wagon. Fair Lady Z from Nissan and also a Nissan Laurel 2000 SGX and then that Aerolift super cool hauler looking great this time around it's got some blue and white and red some Nissan colors um, let's just get to opening and check this thing out let's see here I'm just going to slice this Sliced. Cucumber slice. Alright. Get open without creasing, please. Yeah, that's. Forget that. Alright. Let's see if I can not kill this box. Gonna take an extra second, guys. Here we go. Super excited right now. Done. All right. They got some rubber bands on the cars to keep them in place. Even though this particular one didn't do that great of a job, they have some really cool artwork on this thing. I think I'm going to just get this off first so it doesn't dance too much. And to do that, I'm going to have to back it up. You know what, I'm just going to cut these rubber bands. That's what I'm going to do. Alright. Still on somehow. I'm not really sure how. But it is. Rubber bands off. Hold her out first. Can I really rubber band this thing up good? Alright. Cool. Hauler. Works. Awesome. Metal bottom. Rubber band remnants everywhere. Definitely keep a razor with you when you open yours. I think all rubber bands are off. Okay. Hauler. I'll put this here. Alright. So. We got some of the cars in here still. Let's get these rubber bands out. Let's look at this artwork. Three super cool castings. You can probably see it much better like that. There we go. Three super cool castings. We got a 510 wagon. We got the Fair Lady Z with the uh, front lip that's a little bit lower than some of the other castings you'll see. A lot of the plastic bottoms don't have that extended lower lip. The metal bottoms do. Um, I like to get these metal bottoms because of that. We got these four spokes on this sick seafoam green Datsun wagon, whatever you want to call it. 
Some people may call it sea apple green. That's fancy. And then we got this Ron Burgundy Red Nissan Laurel with the gold wheels, gold four spokes. Let's start taking things out because this box is cool, but these cars are fun to play with. And let's see how we're going to do this. And slice. Slice. All right. Dotson is drippings with goo. All right, get that off. This thing's sick. I mean, super popular in the Hot Wheels community. The Dotson wagon. Look at that front, that grill, those headlights. They did a little detail here on the uh, oil cooler lines. That's awesome. They have your side markers in there. Or not side markers, it'll be blinkers rather if you want to. Side markers here. Uh, orange four spokes with the chrome lip. Kaido house. Uh, super awesome. Very happy to have this thing. Dotson wagon, put it right on the holder. Hopefully that's in the frame there. Next, let's do the Z. White TE37 replicas, six spokes, whatever you want to call them. Simple red and white livery, taillights are done. See a little Fair Lady Z above where the license plate would be. I like the all white, I like the white back there, white bottom, white wheels, red stripes on the side. You got the Z logo right there on the side there too. Headlights are detailed. We've got a little Nissan or Datsun logo right there. Door handles done, keyhole. Awesome. Good job. Good job. Next. I keep bumping this camera. Let's not do that. Alright, cut. Slice. Raise it down. Alright, so there's the artwork. I'm going to toss this box for a second. Definitely not tossing it. I'm going to keep it nice. And let's just get this Nissan Laurel debanded. There we go. Alright. Whoa, look at that on the side. Yokohama Gretti. Little JNC Japanese nostalgia car. Laurel SGX logo. This color is awesome. It's definitely like a deep burgundy and I guess there's a slight metallic to it. Not cover the wheels, four spokes. Nice wide stance, metal bottom. Detail in the front here, we got the headlights, got a chrome grill. Got the Laurel logo right in the center there, the L. And on the back, we got the Laurel logo on the back. We got the red tails done in detail. Got some chrome emblems back there, chrome detail done. Very nice job. I'm really happy with this set. I'm really happy I just opened this thing. I've been dying to find this thing, dying to open it. This wagon, really, I mean, this was, for me, this is the number one car in here. I'm, I know that's like front runner stuff, but I mean, hey, it's gorgeous. Look at it. They did a sick job. They did a really good job on all these. All right, well, I hope you guys uh, liked the video. Definitely feel free to comment. Um, this is John with A to Z diecast. Thank you for watching. I'm definitely, I have a lot more videos to come. I have a lot of stuff to open. There's a front of this thing. I don't think I showed that. A lot of stuff to open. Um, I'm going to try and do it as quick as I can. All the videos will be dropped right on this channel here. 
with Matt. What's going on, Matt? Hope everything's good. And uh, happy hunting out there. Happy New Year, because it is uh, it's New Year's Eve right now, officially. Whoop. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. These things pop out, but pop right back in, so that's all right. We're good, we're good with that now. And um, keep watching these videos, stay tuned. We got a lot of stuff coming. Thanks, later.